And if you'll come to the podium, please. Good evening, everybody, and thank you for the uh, opportunity to be able to give a few updates from the chamber. Uh, with the help of uh, Mayor Striblin and Jeff McMillan, we wrote and submitted a three-star grant for a commercial kitchen and meeting and trading rooms for the new agricultural building that's located at the DeKalb County Fairgrounds. I hope everybody's got to see that building. It's fabulous. And we got the great news that we've been awarded $50,000 and uh, plans for the future to use, utilize this building in numerous ways, including various events, auctions, 4-H programs, culinary and other training classes, and much more. So that's going to be in the next uh, year or so. We'll be able to see uh, quite a few changes there. And speaking of Alexandria, the Alexandria Community Park's new playground that we got with a three-star grant has been well received by Alexandria parents and children alike. So if you've not been able to see that, I hope you'll go down and check that out. And then the Tennessee Commission, Art Commission's grant projects are all complete. Hopefully uh, you've noticed and liked the Welcome to Smithville mural on the side of Savvy Scrubs, the floral mural on DeKalb County Florist Building, the Walnut Salad uh, Alley sign on the Walnut Street side, and a smaller mural in Walnut. So, <clears throat> and then also if you attended this year's Jamboree, you got to see the brand new stage that happened as a result of the Tennessee Tourism Enhancement Grant that we received. Sorry, it's been a long day and my voice is about worn out. Uh, currently, I am writing two more grants that are due this week. The Tourism Marketing Grant, that'll be for a, a Jamboree billboard on I-40 and also for wayfinding signage for the Downtown Business District, Smithville. And that grant's got a 50-50 match. Also, I'm writing a Tennessee Downtowns Improvement Grant for $150,000 for Downtown Smithville. If awarded, this will be very similar to the last three downtown grants I've written where the business or property owners make the 25% match for the exterior improvements that are done. So those two grants will be submitted this week and we'll see what happens. And uh, just thank you so much for your uh, support of the chamber. And does anybody have any questions? Is, is the same artist doing all the painting? Yes, except for the, the sign that's, that leads into the alley. You know, I already gotten a grant for the one on the way, Main Street side, and that we had to, we got someone else. No, no, actually, I think we had to order some parts from somewhere else, but the artist actually rendi you know, did the same rendition. But anyway, um, yeah, the same the artist. Little, little. The Watertown Sun Graphics. And they live in Alexandria. <coughs> yeah. Is there any other questions? And since those murals are done, I've got other people asking me to have some done on their building now. But uh, I hope you're enjoying those. And uh, we'll have some, next time the grants are available, we'll, we'll write some more for the board murals. Is that it? Suzanne, I have a question. <clears throat> you said, I couldn't understand what you were saying about Watertown. I, I don't have my hearing aids in. It's okay, my voice is gone today. Well, uh, we match the <laughs> Sun Graphics in Watertown, but the people who own Sun Graphics in Watertown actually from Alexandria. They live there. They, they don't want to come down to I've been there. begging them. I, oh, yes, yes. <laughs> don't tell the people in Alexandria I said that, though. But yeah, they're, they're awesome people to work with. Mm. Is that it? All right. Yes, All thank, right. You. Thank, thank you. Thank you. Thank you.